I am here, hanging out with my babies right now. I hope you all are doing well. I want to thank you all for a hundred subs. Ah, uh, that's really, really cool. Um, my goal of making videos on this channel isn't uh, to get monetized or to get X amount of subs or anything, but it still feels really good to know that people appreciate these videos and are actually interested in what I have to say about animal care and the world and thank you. Thank you so much. Um, I'm sorry for the uh, air humidifier and the sound of the air purifier in the background. Um, you know, I'll just go ahead and go film in another room. But I wanted to show you these goos first. Because, oh my goodness, these day goos. Hey, hey, hey. That's normal. Day goos. Uh, box. That's one of their behaviors is when they're they're around food or treats or something or even just just kind of for fun and dominance they, they box sometimes. Okay. Let me go film the rest of this uh, someplace where there isn't a bunch of air filters and stuff on in the background. Hey! Sorry about filming earlier before, and now I'm realizing we're up here, and it's not a ton better because I have all these filters and bubblers and uh, lights going, and I'm having trouble controlling the glare in my glasses. Um, but anyway, I just meant this to be kind of a quick video saying thank you for a hundred subs, like I was saying, and also just kind of thinking about what I want to do with these videos because it's never about the size of the platform for me. I just, I do this because I'm really, really passionate about animals and animals as pets, even fish, and taking the amazing, the most amazing care of them you can. And, um, so I always want to express that, but I also want to be interesting and entertaining and bring things to you in a new way where you're not like, okay, there are 10 other videos on this, because or else, otherwise I'm, I'm just making these for me, and I want to make it, it's my dog. I want to make it for the community because I'm seeing so much love in this community. Um, I'm thinking of, just off the top of my head, uh, Panda Boy and Gaming, Chewy Limited, uh, Aqua Hogs, Aqua Star, uh, The Pet Geeko, um, Wild Will, uh, Animal Channel, Chicken Channel, uh, Life for Pets, Pets for Life, sorry. <laughs> Uh, but there's just, there's so many people who have been talking to me and been really kind and awesome and uh, it's great to be a part of the community and I'm hoping to make videos that are both educational and get information out there about animals like goldfish that are kind of mistreated and also videos that are fun for us because you know, I don't really know what I'm doing with life right now. Um, I'm 30 and I've gone back to school for computer coding because um, my initial college degree is in social work, basically. And uh, I've been doing various types of social work and early child education and uh, music for the last 10 years. And it's just not... Um, it's not making ends meet, so I'm back to basically babysitting and being in school 
and I feel like I'm 20 again, which is weird because now I own a house and all these pets and uh, I'm single so it is just me here with all of them and it's wonderful and I hope it's interesting for you all to enjoy. Um, but I definitely don't want to lose my sight of um, making sure that we get educated about animals. Um, so yeah, this was just kind of a ramble, and seriously, thank you! A hundred subs is so much fun! It's never been my goal to a certain amount of subs or anything, but it's just nice to know that people care a little bit. Um, my animals are going kind of nuts, so I'm going to do something with them and then give you guys just a little bit of update on Dumbo Jumbo, my red cap around it, who I've been worrying about a lot. And then that will be the video. Thank you again for 100 subs. The last little bit that I wanted to include in this video is that I have had some friends on here who have been so kind worrying about my red cap Oranda with me. As you can see, she's still hanging in there and sometimes she acts totally and completely normal, but then other times she just hangs out at the top of the tank doing this or is real still at the bottom and I've been doing extra water changes, which they already got plenty. Um, I've been making sure to feed her peas and Epsom salt and duckweed and brine shrimp, uh, fr fresh frozen brine shrimp, and uh, I did treat for flukes and external parasites, but I really don't think that it's an issue of that. I'm really concerned it's just a genetic swim bladder disorder. So anyway, I just wanted to let you all know, I know I've been worrying about her for months and working on, working with her for months, but she's still hanging in there, still doing good a lot of days, um, and thanks for all your well wishes with her. Um, as always, love your pets and they will love you back, your goldfish. Your Henri kitties, your doggies, your dagoos, your mice, whatever. Love them. They'll love you back in their own way. Have a great night.